built this tent Steps so light, I barely touch the ground Everybody wants to know how Brick by brick, I put them in the ground Walk, walk like I built, walk, walk, walk like I built this I do it for my people, family business Yeah struggle with how I want to start these clips off because for me today's Monday so I want to say happy Monday guys but you're watching this on Tuesday so I can't exactly say that but happy Tuesday to you guys it's Monday so I've got a busy day ahead but we're gonna jump right into the video what you're about to see is my workout from Sunday which was back and biceps only recorded back because it was so busy but I'm gonna get into that all after the workout footage and I'm going to explain everything from the recap video and my plan for the next two weeks but let's jump right into the workout footage I'm going to skip to dumbbell row and just go over that really quickly because a lot of people will hold the dumbbell differently than what I do so the first few reps is normal so I'm just bringing it straight back then you'll see I go into bringing the dumbbell out wide my elbow is kind of turned out I like that better because it hits my back a little bit better I feel it more in the lat so I just want to show you guys that, talk about that really quickly. Just a different variation of the dumbbell row. But now, cue the rest of the workout footage. We're going to start from the beginning. Just going to play some music over it, and I will see you guys after that. I feel so alive. I've never felt this way before. It must be you and I. It's got me thinking about us more It's these bright lights in my clear days And I can't stop but think about the way that you Move around up and down on that stage It's your future vibes Bright lights in my clear trance So I feel like I can do it all It's a good life that I really want Again, I forget my sunglasses every time. Am I ever going to learn? Probably not. All right, so let you guys just saw the workout footage. It went okay. Yesterday was Sunday when I recorded that, and it was Sunday when I recorded my recap video. And honestly, I just was not there mentally, physically, just not there. But I still wanted to hit the gym. I wanted to get that recap video recorded for you guys. But I woke up the, that morning. I had a different breakfast than normally. Normally I have eggs and oatmeal, coffee to start off my morning. I wanted to change things up, so I had yogurt, a scoop of protein. And then a little while later, I had Monster. You know, nothing crazy, but then I was doing some work and I went to the gym. I worked out first and then I did my cardio later in the day and I remember I was at the gym stretching like I always do before on the mat and then I got up from stretching just felt lightheaded, dizzy, just totally not there. The gym environment was not good. It was just so packed and I'm like, man, I don't feel good. I want to record this workout and if I don't record it, I'm not going to have time to record Monday's workout because of my schedule and I'm like, you know, I. I was trying to limit my rest time in yesterday's video, yesterday's workout, that was my goal. So I was trying to time that, get to the next exercise, set up my camera, and still you know, get a decent workout in. And the work, work was good. Hit all my reps, hit all my sets for the weights that I wanted, so I was happy with that. But energy was not there, and for the whole day really, just did not feel well at all. I kind of went over my macros actually a little bit because I was just so fr frustrated unfortunately, but my weight was actually good today. Weight was the same, so I was happy with that. Kind of surprised, since I did go over my macros just slightly. But when I recorded the recap video, it was before I left for the workout. So it was when I wasn't feeling well. You know, I was frustrated with how I was feeling, 
so that's why when I went back and edited the recap video I felt like I was kind of all over the place and very negative so I apologize for that and this morning already looking at your guys comments from that video telling me to keep pushing on and that you know it's about how I feel my body not necessarily how I look or the number on the scale and after talking to a bunch of people and getting their advice you know they've known me during my other cuts and all that so they understand where I'm at and taking your advice and rethinking everything I'm going to continue with the cut that is the best thing for me right now and for the future that's that was my goal from the beginning it's what I will continue to do but I'm treating it more of a mini cut so you know normal cut you might go 12 16 sometimes 18 weeks I just completed week six I'm thinking of treating it like a mini cut so it'll be about eight or nine weeks long I'm gonna give it two or three more weeks see how well I do you know that was one day where I felt really bad now today I feel so much better had the same breakfast my eggs and my oatmeal my coffee so I'm back to normal I'm going to keep that consistent give it another two to three weeks on this mini cut I would like to get around 150 to 148 or 147 not as lean as I was in those pictures before because I don't need to get that lean right now but I still want to cut that way when I transition to the next program and I bulk, I start at a good starting weight, not halfway into the uh, cut and then bulk. I think that is the best thing for me. I took everything into consideration that you guys said, that I have reached out to other people from, you know, I got what they said and look back on what's more important and still thinking long term. Continue on, continuing on with this mini cut is still thinking long term and it's going to help me transition into verse dieting and get me to where I want to be in the next few months, years, all that good stuff. So that is the plan. Thank you guys for all the support and the comments from the recap video. That really does help me a lot. It was just yesterday was not a good day mentally or physically and that showed in my videos video yesterday unfortunately so I do apologize for that but like I said before I'm not perfect not every day is going to be great and I show you guys that. I don't want to act like everything is wonderful and it's easy to lose weight or gain weight because it's not. So this is me being transparent, showing you guys everything. But that is going to do it for this video. Like I said, Mondays are always my busy day. And the focus was to get you my workout from Sunday, the back workout, and then to tell you my plans for furthering for the rest of the mini cut. So with that being said, that's our plan. If you guys have any comments or questions about that, please leave that down below. Continue to add comments down there. If you've never commented before, I'd just love to hear what you guys say. And I'd love to know when you watch these videos, when it comes right out or later on in the day. But thank you guys so much for the support. I really do love it. And I am so excited for my birthday video. So hang on tight for that. That'll be April 22nd. I already recorded it and edited it and everything. And it's one of my best videos. So again, that'll be this Friday. But thank you so much. Like, comment, share, subscribe if you have not already. And as always, have a great day.